what's up cancer baby how are you guys doing welcome to black madonna hp's table etiquette i hope you guys enjoyed your weekend hope you guys are having a good time not being in that energy that i seen you guys in last time because i'm getting ready to see the person that's getting ready to enter your life for the month of october so let's see like who's coming in hopefully they can put a smile on that beautiful face all that cancer you guys don't forget to check out blackmadonnahp.com there you'll find some beautiful clothing items for men and women definitely supply stuff for the grown and sexy so you want to make sure that you check that out once again that's blackmadonnahp.com but let's go ahead and get into your message beloved who is the person oh who is the person that's entering the life of cancer please who's the person that's entering the life man your energy is popping i can't keep these cards in my hand who's the person that's entering the life of cancer please Short term, mature woman, chew gem. Oh snap! Oh, you know, you know, one of those moments, Cancer, where you just gotta blow on it for a minute and be like, "Let me take it all in." You know, Cancer. This, this is someone I feel like that initially didn't see your value, didn't see your worth, right? I feel like this is someone who maybe tried to play you or tried to um, act like you wasn't special to them or, um, or um, just was playing the field, right? This was someone who liked to play games. Um... Let me tell you a little secret you may not know, Cancer. And you could take this as the male or female. Now, the person I'm picking up is a, a player. Now, this is the type of person. They like they like notches under their belt. It's a it's an ego boost. It's a self-esteem issue. It's an ego boost, right? So they like notches under their belt. So they always seen you knew you're worth all that they just thought they couldn't get you and when they got you it was like an ego boost right as long as they could keep you and have you under their notch they knew they was the shit right i feel like i feel like in some ways it backfired on them right because playing you was only playing they self because one thing they wasn't expecting when they met you, Cancer, was to fall in love, right? But why do I feel like this person couldn't let go of them bullshit-ass ways that they had before they met you? Why do I feel like this was someone that may have treated and took you for granted during this, um, during this relationship? But now they're seeing like exactly what this relationship is. I feel like Cancer, when I get in your energy, there's this deep sadness that's like in this in this energy, and I feel like it could be you or it could be like your um this person that's coming back in October. I'm sorry, I get the coming back type of energy. But um this person just didn't treat you right, wasn't right to you, right? A word of advice, don't never let no motherfucker cancer know that they got you. Always keep a person on their toes. Because the minute they know they got you, they they take full advantage of that situation. I, I just, just, hey, it just seemed like it is what it is with that one. But yeah, don't never let a person know that they got you. It seems like, like it's game plan or something like that. But aren't you tired of getting your heart broke, cancer? Oh my goodness, your energy is popping. I don't know who is, is uh, ready to talk, but let's go ahead and get the cards out before sh these cards explode in my damn hand. Why is short term here, please? Let me get four, please. Oh, 
<laughs> the Knight of Wands. Or the Page of Wands, rather. The Nine of Cups. Hold on. That's crazy. The Four of Pentacles and the um the Five of Pentacles. <laughs> you know why I'm laughing, Cancer? You like a fantasy to this damn person. Ooh, they did not think they could get you or pull you or I'm telling you, maybe you don't know, Cancer, how you look or how you come off, right? But whoever this person right here was, this player, this whatever, they had a lot of people. They was a hoe. Player, hoe, call it what you want to. But for some reason, they did not think they could get you. You, you stood out from the crowd. You stood out from the rest. And you know what's crazy, Cancer? With you not knowing your value, your worth, this motherfucker put you on the shelf, baby, with the rest of the... And let me see who I want to play with today. Let me see. Today, Monday. No, I ain't going to call him today. I'll call him tomorrow. Okay, I'm going to call. You understand what I'm saying? Yeah. They was like, a, I'll get back to Cancer. When I get back to Cancer. This was, this was their logic. This is the way that they psh, thought about it. Like, I got cancer now, shoot, I'm good, like, whatever. That shit caught up to them. But that's exactly how they was thinking. Like, they got you. What they got to put in work for when they know they got you, right? Why is mature woman here? They didn't like this one. Ooh, somebody did not like this right here. The Ten of Cups, the Moon, the Seven of Wands, and um, the Tower. Now, I don't know if you blocked them, they blocked you, Cancer, but somebody felt that shit in their soul, in their spirit, right? Cancer, it was like you had enough or something. Why do I feel like you found something out about this person? Which you should have already knew because all them goddamn red flags was beaming on you, Cancer. <laughs> but you got to pay attention. All those red flags were like jumping at you. For some reason, you didn't pay attention. But somebody was hot as all outdoors. Super hot. They could have found out. I don't know if you found out about this person, like being in another relationship with somebody or this person trying to play you for somebody or you trying to play this person for somebody. But whoever energy this is, somebody was hot when this came out. Hot. I feel, I feel, you know what I feel like, Cancer? I feel like it's fucking up their money flow. But the seven of wands... Like, she trying to be professional and everything and concentrate, but this shit, this red stuff that's all around her is getting to her, okay? Somebody, yeah, somebody had a blow to the gut, and I think it was um, your person cancer. Yeah, because they, for whatever this was that they were trying to hide from you, this came out when they least expected it to. I don't even think they were... They were thinking that this would come out like this is supposed to be something that you ain't supposed to find out, right? Because I want you stuck to me like glue. I got your ass wrapped around my finger type vibe, right? So whatever this thing was you found out about, wow. Extracurricular activity is what I just picked up. Somebody was doing some extracurricular activity, huh? <laughs> I don't know. I'm, I'm not surprised being what they came out of. Why is True Jen here? Wow. <laughs> wow. Wow. El Diablo. The Three of Wands. The Two of Pentacles. In the Knight of Pentacles, they, uh, they uh, 
your person got issues. Okay, Cancer? They got issues because this slow person, they going to, um, they coming back in October, slow foot as hell. I don't know if they ready for anything solid or real or whatever because their whole thing is to try and stretch it out as long as possible. It's like this person's whole mindset is um like letting it burn or something. Like they want you to feel um feel what they feel or something. This person know that they screwed up or they messed up in some type of way, but they don't want you to know that they messed up. This is a real immature ass person. No wonder they show up as a page of ones, right? They ain't on nothing. You know, I feel like I feel like the reason why they coming back is it's coming back to that I got to keep you wrapped around my finger as energy and right now they don't know whether or not they still got you like that. They know your power, they know your worth, but they don't know if they still got you like they had you. I feel wow, I'm getting some real harsh stuff. I feel like this was a cheating ass dog. Who is this person? I'm going to bring out some other cards for you. Hold on. Tell me about Kansas person. Cheating ass dog, huh? Wretched ass bitch. Oh, wow. Plenty of material things. Teardrop, great personal sorrow. Torch, spiritual development, enlightenment, awareness, and understanding. Mining property through an inheritance, winning or windfall. January, oh my goodness. January, it's October right now. They gonna stretch this shit out to January, Cancer? Oh my goodness. The most difficult part of a situation is over. And broken will bring, pardon up the ways in either romance or business. Yeah. So this person, oh my goodness. You could be dealing with the earth sign with all this damn money energy surrounding it, right? But this person, it feels like either they want to leave you in this energy or you leaving them in this energy because I see this parting of ways either in romance or business so it's definitely some deep ass heartbreak here right but it's like it's like the way they're gonna try to deal with the cancer is by like focusing on everything else but your motherfucking ass cancer this is a, someone who either I get it as torture torturing you or you torturing them but this person I pray they not finna drag it out to January because you know what this is someone that's not willing to take accountability for their actions when they know they was a dirty dog the most difficult part of a situation is over so whatever happened to you guys like I mean it's all up from here if you want it but I'm just saying, they finna drag this out. This is this is something that, that I feel like you gonna feel and this person gonna feel, okay? Either you gave this person something they could feel or they gave you something they can feel. But I feel like whoever this person is was a dirty dog. They got found out and yeah, it just, yeah. It just ain't rocking that way. And I feel like for the fact of you finding out, they want to make you like suffer for it or something. I don't know what the hell going on with this person, Cancer. It got me confused. Let's see how this person feel about you. Lord have mercy. How does this person feel about Cancer, please? How does this person feel about Cancer? Oh, okay, okay. I get it. <laughs> you know, this person. <laughs> this this person that's crying and going through stuff. I am grateful for the spiritual lessons. I am becoming a better person. I am afraid to contact you. Okay, so this is this person's karma and what they're getting ready to go through. Why they're dragging it out, Cancer, because they they were a dirty ass dog. Male, female, call it what you want to, right? But it's like, 
I guess this person is going through a spiritual awakening and that's what's going to take so damn long because this person might be a little rebellious towards the beginning. I know I was a distraction from your pain. You know what? I get why they made this card, but a distraction from your pain. When this person says, I know I was a distraction from your pain, it's like you're the one that was causing the damn pain. The only distraction from it was other things in my life. But you were the root cause of the damn pain, right? Well, either way, this person knows. They Let me see. Yep. I knew it. I couldn't let you get close to me. Yep. Because this person... They had too much going on to let you get close. But I guess now that their true gem is gone, now that their cancer ain't acting the same way or being the same way. Oh, yeah. Now they got to go through the spiritual journey. And this is what's going to take a minute is that. So the person cries over you, misses you. But uh, they got to go through this awakening. Let them go ahead, go through a cancer. You take care of you, do what you got to do. And uh, God got everything else, beloved. Okay. Either way, Cancer, thank you guys for tapping into Black Madonna and HP. It was conf a confusing ass reading. So I hope you guys got as much as you could out of it because this person's all over. And I feel like that's why the cards were jumping at the beginning of the reading. Either way, you guys, don't forget to check out blackmadonnahp.com. Don't forget to like and share, subscribe, comment. And until next time, love, peace, and so. Take care.